This video lesson is about area of rectangle. So what is area? Area, it is the space occupied by a flat shape. So in this lesson, I will show you the area of a rectangle. So how to get the area of rectangle? We're going to use the formula. So the formula in getting the area of rectangle is A equals L times W. So in the rectangle, L is the length or the longest side and W is the shortest side of a rectangle. So let me show you my example so that we can proceed the the process on how to get the area of rectangle. So example number one. So I have here a rectangle which has length which has length of two meters and width of three meters. So we're going to use the formula A equals L times W. So just substitute the length and the width, the measurement of the length and the width. Substitute, so the length is equivalent to 2 meters and the width is equivalent to 3 meters. So we just multiply the length and width and the answer for this is 6 meters. So again, multiplied by meter or m times m it will give you us meter squared or squared meter so the answer for this example is a equals six meter squared or six squared meter so let's try another example example number two so again i am here a rectangle which has a width of five meters and a length of eight meters so we just uh, use the formula and just substitute the measurements of length and width so the length is eight meters and the width is five meters so we just multiplied the number eight multiplied by five it will give you a 40. so the answer for it is the area of this rectangle is a equals 40 meters squared so example number three so again a rectangle has a width of four meters and a length of 10 meters so formula l times w just substitutes the measurement of length and width so 10 meters times 4 meters it will give you a 40 meters squared is it easy right so let's try two more examples so example number four so a rectangle has a width of 9 meters and a length of 12 meters so we're going to use a formula a equals l times w just substitutes the measurements of length and width which is 12 multiplied by 9 so what do you think is the answer for this example so 12 if we multiply it by 9 it will give you a 108 so just use the proper unit which is a squared units or the squared meters or meter squared so get ready for our last example example number five so it has six meters width and a length of 10 meters so just use the formula and just substitute so what do you think is the answer for this rectangle and also the proper uh, units used in this sample so what do you think is the answer let's 
great is it is 16 meters squared or 60 squared meter so get ready for your activity time so find the area of each rectangle so i have here a first rectangle which measures nine meters in length and four meters in width second rectangle 11 meters length and nine meters width and the last rectangle has a measurement of nine centimeters in length and two centimeters in width so can you guess or can you find the area of each rectangle i will give you a 30 seconds for this activity so your 30 seconds starts now Twenty seconds. Ten seconds. Five seconds. Time is off. So let's find out. If your answer is just like my answer so the area of the first rectangle is 36 M squared because it multiplied the 9 by 4 and the answer for this for the product is 36 and the uh, for the number 2 or for the second rectangle the answer is 99 we just multiplied 11 by 9 and the product will be 99 and last rectangle is 18 just multiply 9 by 2 and it will give you an 18 so the proper units for this has a squared units so see you on my next lesson